up divas it's your girl april and it is time for another hair review this one is by ir hair and i hope that's how you pronounce it because i don't really think that it would be called er hair you know what i'm saying like that would not be too cool but anyway so i've had this hair for like a month i finally was able to finish it um and i have finally finished and styled it last night actually so yes the video is long overdue i do apologize i are here but you know i am super busy and i do give a time frame of like five to six weeks it is what it is however they did send me some really pretty hair um four bundles of brazilian body wave i went a little bit shorter this time so i have two 20s and 18 a 16 and a 14 inch close so of course I always wash the hair after I make the wig I really don't see the sense in getting on here with some dirty hair and though to some it may not be dirty but to me I don't really know where the hair has been whose head it's been on what it's been doing while it was in the factory so I just find it really important to wash the hair after or before you get it installed um, that way you can see the true luster the true texture the trueness of the daggone hair itself so with this hair I went ahead I got a closure I'm just like not just getting into the frontals I have made a few um, that I have been somewhat pleased with but you know what I will I will cross that bridge when I have the time to so with this one I just sold three combs like I normally do and I went ahead and made a middle straight part this time I try to keep it simple and basic as possible because with the middle part you don't have to adjust the part you don't have to change the part you don't have to train the hair you can basically wear it to the left or the right or the middle whatever your fancy middle. is so today, I did not cut the hair I left it in its original state of course you guys know these are wand curls I love wand curls because they do actually help the density the fullness the volume of the hair so that is what i went to do with it when i washed it it did tangle a little bit and yes it did shed the actual closure the knots in it are decent um on a scale of one to ten what would i give this hair i would probably give it like a seven and a half only because i'm not one that likes the little tiny short hairs here and there but it did hold up really really well um, I did do a strand test on one of the pieces of hair that was left behind and it is custom to bleach although I only did a 20 developer um, just keep that in mind that it did work well and it didn't smoke and burn up so let's yes lady let's get into this um, of course like I said this is a closure I'm not gluing anything down or anything like that yeah, yeah. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah. It's body, baby, oh, body, baby, oh, na, 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 yeah. It's your happy day, uh -huh. it's your wedding day, uh -huh. make we celebrate, uh -huh. make we celebrate, uh -huh. to make you dance, dance, uh -huh. and make you move, move, uh -huh. make you dance, dance, uh -huh. and make you move, move, if I die, you know, go, go, if I die, you know, yeah, yeah. So I go give you daughter. She go call you mommy. Okay, you guys. And she go so she came out really cute, really pretty. I don't. You know what? I think they put the wrong lens in the actual email because this is where I got the lens from that it was 20 inches and then I had to go downstairs and look at the paper that was sent to me um, along with the hair and it was actually 22 inches so this is more or less like 22 inches and it's pretty hair it looks cute I like the way it formed its own little kind of like style going on whatever um, they held so well these are two day old curls as well um, and I say as well because I just did another video prior to this one with the same shirt on and the curls was like um, two days old too. Um, for this particular one and how I got the curls to stay in this, you guys know I use Aussie all the time. I swear by this product. It's the best thing on the market. But before I start curling the hair, I will section the hair off like either in two sections like half and half or four sections and i will take the aussie mousse hair and okay. i'll take some mousse and i'll evenly distribute it through the hair and brush it through so that way when i'm curling it there's no flyaways the curls will hold and it'll just look really sleek and i won't have to put a whole bunch of hairspray on it 
to let the curls hold. But after I'm done like styling the whole unit, that's when I do spray the Instant Freeze Aussie on it. I'm like so done with this natural lighting. I always try to film during the daytime because that is the best lighting and my room is all lit up, but it is really irritating me today because um yeah so that is why my light keeps going in and out you guys seen i just put it on a middle straight part and if i really wanted to change it um and wear it to the opposite side or to the middle i don't have to do anything i can't stand to have to retrain a wig part so i just try to make it as simple as possible for myself what i use um i did show this in a couple of videos quite a few videos i use this in every single video but i did do like a full detail tutorial um for this brand um this product which is the topic hair building fibers the color that i use is dark brown it's full hair instantly as you guys know my edges are thin so i try to camouflage them the best i can and i do have a video on youtube showcasing that um but prior to me i was also styling a synthetic wig so you will see it more in depth but this is a really great product especially if you have balding thinning thinning edges there's no needed hairspray or anything like that. The pump does not come with this, so you would have to purchase this top separately, but an amazing product. For the hair, it came out great. Um, if you're looking for something that's affordable, there are so many different vendors. You have to basically take it upon yourself and be mindful of what vendor you choose to purchase from. Um, it did shed, like I said, and when I curled it, it curled very nicely. Um, a little bit of the hairs broke off as I was curling them, nothing major, but I will say this, it did take to some bleaching with a 20 developer. Um, there weren't any split ends, there was not a foul scent, the closure is very decent, and the bundles are very decent as well. So with that being said, I will post all of IR's hair's information below for you guys so that way you can check it out. And as always, stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. I love you guys and I will see you in a soon to come video. Check.